much does a combo session cost? Well, the price of your combo session is going to depend largely on a number of factors such as the experience of the practitioner, whether you're in a private or group setting, or even the country that you're in. In the US, for example, the average cost is in a range of between 50 US dollars to 300 US dollars. Generally, private sessions cost more than group sessions, with groups being between 50 to $200 and private sessions being usually between $100 and $300. If you're in another country, such as Peru, then you might be able to find a session for as little as $30. Choosing the right practitioner and setting. Given that there is a large range of prices, it's important to know what you're looking for. For example, if you know that you are more likely to get results in an immersive retreat environment with no distractions, then you might end up paying more for a full encompassed retreat experience. If you know that you have a chronic condition or complex illness that may require specific knowledge or expertise from a type of practitioner, that's good to know as well. Or perhaps you know that you can feel more comfortable in letting go in a private setting versus a group setting. Many accidents are due to practitioner error, so you want to make sure and ask your practitioner what type of safety protocols they have in place, and if they don't do a medical screening for contraindications, you might want to go look for a different practitioner. Traditional versus modern. There are many styles of administering combo, including traditional methods and modern approaches. While there can be wisdom and beauty in the traditional application, I want to remind you that these traditional applications were not developed necessarily for Westerners that have different lifestyle and afflictions than the indigenous natives. In many cases, modern methods may be more suitable for a Western participant than a traditional administration method. Traditionally, for example, there is no ceremony or ritual or songs. So by default, if any of those elements are present in your combo experience, it is already a, an innovated and more modern adaptation of the combo experience, which is not necessarily a bad thing. It's important that we stay open-minded and that we really focus on prioritizing our safety and comfort in the experience and not get too attached to any dogma about tradition or how, it, how we think it should be applied. You get what you pay for. Remember, there is always someone who will do it cheaper. And I'll remind you that doing combo can be a vulnerable experience, both physically and emotionally, and you're putting your life in this practitioner's hands. So you wanna make sure that the person that you are hiring for this job feels competent and experienced in keeping you safe and guiding you through so that you can get benefit. I find often that when a practitioner has charged really low rates, it's usually because they're not very experienced or they have a low sense of self value. I know many people that have been traumatized and endangered by reckless, negligent practitioners. So remember that this is an investment in yourself and paying for a qualified and skilled practitioner can make all of the difference in whether your experience is beneficial or not. So remember, investing in a good combo experience is investing in yourself and your healing and you are absolutely worth it. There's many creative avenues to finding a combo practitioner near you, but I've made it easy and I've made a website directory that you can look up combo practitioners in your area and even filter through uh, different experience levels, prices, locations, certifications, and specialties. So go check out combofinder.com and start looking for your practitioner today.